Welcome back to another vlog. I'm Alana if you are new here. And it is currently Monday morning. It's 11 10 a.m. We have a slow start today. It's currently raining out. I let myself sleep in and I went and got some groceries because I was running low. So we'll do a little grocery haul. I feel like I've been doing so many grocery hauls in my videos. Um, okay. We just got the basics because I'm gonna do a proper order um, later. But picked up some spinach and kale. These are both like $2.99 each. Maybe the kale is $3.99. Got a thing of lactose-free Greek yogurt love this picked up some blueberries and strawberries the strawberries are definitely on their way out um they've seen better days the organic blueberries were a full dollar cheaper so i always like to compare that eggs and chicken i'm gonna make the chicken tonight so it doesn't go bad because last week my chicken went bad before i could use it and we're not gonna let that happen this week but i'm going to have oats for breakfast because that is what I'm feeling like. I'm just going to put these away in the fridge and then I'm going to make the oats and I'm going to get started on some work. I ran into Zach. I haven't seen him in so long. Um, so that was, a, that was lovely. A lovely surprise. Also got a coffee from French Made because I was out of milk and I also realized I did not get milk at Farm Boy. Um, but I went to French Made because they had 50% off latte, so it was only $2. Um, my only plans for today is I have to run later. I know I was switching to morning workouts, but this morning was just a slow start. I don't want to get my day started. So I'm going to run later. I'm meeting Jen for coffee at 2. And that's about it. I want to edit the YouTube video that went up before this one and get that up. And yeah, so happy Monday. Hope you're enjoying the vlog and make sure to subscribe so you always know when a new video is up. I didn't vlog this weekend on Halloween. It was just like kind of chaotic and I was honestly like dead half the time like during the day, like super chill days. And also spending a lot of time with Shayna because she left for vancouver for this to this morning and i won't be seeing her for a month um until i go to vancouver which will be really exciting never been so i didn't vlog hell weekend but it was a lot of fun i went out on friday and saturday i don't think i'm gonna go out tonight okay <laughs> hello you guys i need to fix my hair i'm gonna going to record quickly and then i have to use the blow dryer but I've been so shitty at vlogging this week. I'm so sorry. But I went to the most beautiful event today. It was sound bath and it was like at 10.30. And the fact that <laughs> I'm able to take the time out of my day to go to an event like this and I'm able to and I get to be there because of work is truly still amazing and mind like mind blowing. So I need to clean this brush. Um, Quite badly but I don't know it was kind of just like a pinch me moment last night I spoke with my psychic and her reading on me was just like it was the first time I had like a reading where it was like all like really positive I know that actually just like felt nice because I was able to leave that feeling really good and i'm excited to see if the things will happen i don't know all my psychic readings have always been like pretty accurate so i'm excited there are exciting things happening but i'm gonna be meeting steph at the hotel in a bit for steph's birthday she turns 25 today um we're gonna do a little coffee work date and yeah i need to fix my hair because i did it quickly before i went to the event and the humidity just ruined it but we're going to blow it out again and then curl it so
camera died, so I didn't end up vlogging much because I needed to charge the battery. Maybe note to self, I need to invest in a second battery. But just making my morning coffee. I'm going to do my skincare and get ready. I'm not working out this morning. I don't know if I'm going to work out today. I think I might take my rest day today. But I have a meeting at 10. I'm meeting Harold, who is the founder of Fight Club here in Toronto. He, I met him when I went and worked out with him and Taylor, um, Taylor Frankel. She owns Nude Sticks. So the Fight Club is like near where I live and they do like kind of like, it's kind of like dog pound-esque um, like weightlifting and small classes. They also do boxing and stuff. So I definitely would love to go there more often, but we have a meeting at 10, so that will be fun. He's a really nice guy. But just making my latte over here. Um, I had, sorry if this is loud. I'll tell you in one moment. Okay, we're back. How do, so I woke up at seven when my first alarm went off. And then I went back to bed and I had such, should we try to make latte here? I don't know how to do anything. I kind of made a heart. You guys! <laughs> I'm finished telling my story in a moment. Look at my cutie little heart. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just chaotic this morning. Um, I had a nightmare and it was, we were in a car, we were in a taxi and Kaylee and Trin were with me, I don't know why. And like, to put into context, like I don't dream, like I don't have dreams, except like when they're like really like intrusive dream, it's an intrusive loop, lucid dreaming, <laughs> the thing about that, except when it's like a lucid dream or like a nightmare and I went back to bed. We were in the car, like we were driving like a taxi and it was like, I was in the middle and Kaylee was on my right and Trin was on my left. I think Trin was on my left. I don't know. I just remember Kaylee being on my right. And I remember driving, we were driving through like where I grew up and I remember seeing all these condos and we we're talking about like the condo buildings going up and how it's a completely different city, blah, blah, blah. And then in the back, like I see like smoke. I'm like, there's a fire behind us. And then I see like this car, like kind of like driving all over the place and like the front engine is like on fire or whatever and the taxi driver like isn't like speeding up getting out of the way like sort of thing and the car comes behind us and like a spark this literally makes no sense the spark like somehow gets on our car so then like our car is on fire and i'm like we need to get out we need to stop and like get out and like the taxi driver isn't like stopping and so then i like as the car like he's like moving slower because i don't know something's happening to the taxi driver so then I opened the door over Kaylee and I literally like grab a, some bag. I don't know what bag I grabbed, but I grabbed like a tote bag and I like stop, drop, and roll. I guess I didn't really stop, but I like jumped and rolled out of the car and then like I ran to like a gas station and like asked them to call 911 and explained what happened and then I woke up. So, love that for me. Happy Wednesday, said my dreams. Um, but I'm gonna take my. Six. out and we're gonna go do our skincare while having like a lovely coffee but you saw this in the last vlog so i'm not gonna bore you with that if you want to check out how i use these fun boys go watch the last vlog a lot of times they'll have a track in their ear that says like every three words or something so that they don't forget the words or that they do Boxers 
that I got from American Eagle. They're just like men's boxer short brief situation. I think boxer shorts. Size medium. Got them for my Halloween costume. Best purchase ever. So comfortable. Could also style them out if I wanted to. But just me in my bed. Oh, ruined it by stepping on it. But sleeping with this weighted blanket last night. Everything. Besides my nightmare this morning. This was everything. And it's so cute. So I like having it out. It's by Bear Bee. I went to an event with them yesterday. And I absolutely love. But we're going to film a little bit of a TikTok. Like for get ready with me. I'm going to get ready in the process. And yeah. Hair and makeup is done. Just kept it super nice and light. I have a pimple like right in my cupid's bow. And it's not fun. I do not like lip pimples. They hurt. Hair is like leftover from yesterday. Kind of vibing. Feeling super productive today. Haven't been that productive this week because it's been more like social things, but just finished up editing the vlog before this in at Ace Hotel and I just need to go home. I'm going to make lunch. I'm leaving because I'm hungry. My computer is going to die soon. Just need to add some music and then I'll export it and upload it. But you know, feeling really good. Feeling a bit more on schedule and work life balance. Should I have Steph's birthday dinner? So I'm going to sort that out. Probably I'll go for a walk in a bit since I haven't really done movement today and I'm not planning on working out today. Okay. I didn't film anything from earlier. But I just got back from Steph's birthday. We went to Harriet's and then we went to Mademoiselle. Currently, this is my go-to post night out. Just a slice of toast. Probably they'll have a square of chocolate. Chug some water. Call it a day. I need to take my makeup off. But yeah. Hope you're enjoying the vlog. This is what I'm sleeping in. These boxers, I think I spoke about them earlier. I'll talk to you guys in the morning. I'm going to run in the morning. I'm going to do my recovery run, which is, I think it's 3.2K, so like two miles. So I'll do that in the morning. See you then. What is this? You guys, <laughs> it's so foggy. I don't think I've ever experienced this in my life in the past year of living down here. <laughs> Holy fuck. It was foggy last night. Uh, but I feel like it, because it was dark, you couldn't see it. Also, hello, good morning, happy Thursday. I don't think I have anything till later today. I'm going to... I'll run later. I don't feel like running right now. I'm a little hungover. Actually, no. Okay, I'm not hungover. I'm just tired. But I'm going to put this sweatsuit on and I'm going to go on a little walk. Because I don't want to run right now. Also, because I can't eat this early and I want to have energy for my run. It's just easier to run than I've eaten before. So, oh my god. It's so spooky out. I know um, Starbucks has Christmas stuff this morning. Which is so cute. Maybe we'll go and be festive together. But I really want to make coffee at home, so I don't know. Maybe we'll be festive. I'll report back on that. I put self tan on last night. I don't know. I'm not wearing contacts right now, so I don't know what it looks like. But my hair looks good. 
Okay, you guys, I'm gonna go get dressed. I'll be right back. Cutie little fit. Wearing the boyfriend mega sweats. I think these are the tall ones. The cropped boxy boyfriend zip up. My thrifted Danier leather jacket. My ultra mini Uggs. I got these sunglasses from Vela. They came in the mail yesterday. I would like to wear them, but it is not sunny, so they're cute. This is the fit. I'm gonna go grab Starbucks. <laughs> extra small slouch jacket in the mail it fits so much better so we're returning the small just brewed the perfect espresso shot we're gonna froth our milk and then in a little bit i'm gonna go run i think um before we go to the event at permission tonight for their two year but honestly today i'm a little bored i think i'm gonna i'll go run in a bit feeling like lazy and kind of bored. I don't really have that much work to do today, so. You know, it comes in waves, and next week I'll have more to do because I'll start my work with for Adriana. But this week is simply slow, and I'm trying to just like enjoy it because I know I've been on the other side where I've been like so busy that I haven't been able to think. So I'm just letting myself breathe and be okay with being chill. Going to add some of my 1111 adaptogenic mushrooms into my coffee because I didn't earlier and I got these ashwagandha tablets by the brand Slowly. I ordered them yesterday, two days ago. I've been wanting to take it again but I only have it in a powder form and I don't really want to be putting in like smoothies all the time. So I got these peppermint melt away tablets um, from the brand Slowly. Super, super cute packaging. It has vitamin D3. KSM66 ashwagandha, which is apparently like the one that you want. Um, but my plan, I tried one already because I was like, kind of want to try, I feel a little anxious. Had one, pretty good. I'm gonna have it at night with magnesium. My psychic told me to, and then also like strangely, like Adriana told me to on Tuesday when I saw her. So I'm gonna start incorporating that. Ashwagandha is great for like stress, um, anxiety, and helps us sleep. So I'm gonna incorporate that and see. But I'm currently crafting up a little um, like 40 day challenge for you guys to like end the year off strong and get you like into a good mindset and just like find balance in the holiday chaos. So I'm in the process of putting that all together. I think it will be really fun, something that we can all do together. attempting and then I just kind of gave up but I feel like I can almost do it the latte art <laughs> after some procrastination and a little five minute clean we're gonna go run I did some work I edited a video filmed some filming a run video as well and feeling a bit better we're feeling a bit better in a better headspace and i'm sure this run will do me some good so yeah i really want hokas for running the ones i want are sold out i really want the clifton eights in white so but i do really like these nikes i just don't want to destroy one pair this is the fit 
We're just wearing the V short from 437 with the micro bra top. My Hulu little um, perfectly oversized crew. It's the older one. So let's go run. Point of view, you left your apartment and it was foggy and dark and you come back from your run, your mind is clear, you feel better, it was definitely a therapy run and your apartment is lit with the most beautiful daylight and it's your favorite thing ever. And it was just such a nice surprise to walk into. You guys, like you're kidding. You're kidding, look at this. You're kidding. Ignore my pile of clothes. But, um, thank you. Like, kind of beautiful, guys. Like, okay. Thanks, Mother Nature. I just ran, did 4K, felt really, really good. I'm really happy I did that. I almost didn't. You'll never regret a workout. Never, ever, ever. These are the shoes I wore, if you're wondering. I realize I also haven't had lunch, so we should probably do that. I guess it will be a liner situation. I think I'm gonna do a salad with canned tuna. I think that's what I'm gonna do. And yeah. this fog <sighs> literally can't see anything so foggy so spooky I just got home from the permission event got a little goodie bag we went to celebrate their two year anniversary. Oh my god, this is so exciting. Okay. Pumpkin spice snack conscious. These are so yummy. Our crew socks, these are the 437 ones. I really do love these. Cute. It's a little clip by AI Toronto. Really cute. This is the brand little ember wellness facial oil it's morella and almond very cute also a toronto brand an exfoliating mitt a little lip and under eye patches essential balm lisa goslin coupon coupon for the reset method oh and another formula fig coupon thing I wonder what it's for but thank you permission for having me at your lovely event love you Amanda and Laura yeah my hair is so greasy but we may do this is what I do when my hair is really greasy um well it wasn't really greasy it was just like borderline greasy from my run but I curled her I put a shit ton of dry shampoo the Amica one and then I put into a high pony and then curl the front pieces and that's the finished look. Yay! Okay. Um, I had some sushi at the bed, but I didn't really have dinner. I'm gonna have a little snack slash chocolate and maybe one of these pumpkin spice balls. Let's do a little taste test. You never know how I feel about pumpkin, but these are good. Yeah, tomorrow is going to be a good day. Oh, and then I'm going to Gia for the first time with Nicole. This is what I wore. I wore my leather jacket on top and then my new balances. Okay, good night. a little long.
latte. I have therapy starting like now. She should be hauling me soon. Um, it's my first therapy session in a really long time. I'm kind of nervous, like my stomach hurts. I think it's just nerves. I haven't had therapy since September 15th or 16th, like since I got back from New York. So it's been a while, I'm a bit nervous. I don't know, I feel like it'll be good. I've had a few family things happen. So it'll be nice to just like talk that through professionally. I feel like I've handled it really well just from having like my toolbox. Like that's the benefit of therapy is it gives you, at least like I do CBT, so it's cognitive behavioral therapy. So essentially like you're rewiring the way you think and process things and manage situations and problems and everything. I feel like after everything I've been through a lot this summer, like a lot of like family stuff. And I feel like from being in therapy throughout that, that's also helped me because whatever. Um, I watched, well not whatever, but I'm not gonna continue going on a tangent over here. Um, okay, I gotta go, she's calling me. this for breakfast yesterday and i felt full for so long and so satisfied so it's just three eggs with grass-fed salted butter like made soft scramble with a little salt and olive oil on top and then a little zero percent greek yogurt blueberries strawberries this maple spice granola from rosa nut it's not my favorite flavor because it's not super sweet um so just do a little bit and then a little bit of almond butter I eat the eggs and then I have this, but I just, it's very protein heavy and I don't know, I just, yesterday kept me full for so long, so we're trying it again today. I think I really like this approach. I had um, eggs and avocado and like a green smoothie at Impact on Saturday last week. I felt really good, so this like eggs and like a yogurt bowl or a smoothie of some sort really really good i was just working on some stuff i just changed i'm gonna go walk to meet up with staff we're gonna grab coffee before my workout at 12 30. just taking a little tote bag with me wearing a sports bra this long sleeve zip up my 5 30s because it's more of a weightlifting workout and I get to wear my new vela sunglasses but i'm gonna go meet up with staff it's not